Hey gentlemen, how we doing? So today is my birthday, February 8th. Having a dinner. <clears throat> we have uh, Michelle's kids coming here. Today I'm going to be using this here. I got it from Vitamin Cottage for uh, about $2.50 off. It's the uh, Thayer's Shaving Cream with Witch Hazel and Aloe. So it's got the lid like the bottle and brand spanking new. I've never used this before and actually I thought it was something different than shave soap. I wouldn't have bought it if I wouldn't thought it was shave soap. I, was, I thought it was like a <clears throat> cream cream uh, witch hazel but I'm going to use this and uh, it's probably a little too much but that's uh, all right. So um, I'm going to use this and what I'm going to do today is I'm going to cut down this beard. Uh, you know, right now, it, I think it looks cool as hell. You know, I really do. You know, in the mirror, in the damn mirror, it's my, you know, natural, my, my lights. And you go outside, and I was looking at myself in the mirror, and going, oh, man, that thing's got to come off. So it's going to come off. I'll be right back. All right. Now, after I get this thing shaved down, I'm going to use uh, this uh, Taylor Roll Bond Street tobacco leaf from uh, James. Not James. Joseph. Sorry. What I want to do, I think... I'm going to experiment real quick and I want to uh, attach this thing here. How do you get this thing on there? Jeez, uh, I've never used this before. Oh, there we go. Let's see how this is going to cut. So let's do that real quick. Messy, 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 messy. All right, now the soap is not lathering up very good. I don't think. Uh, you've had it in dipper. But um, I'm just going to go for it, huh? First thing I'm going to do is cut in these sideburns. And create a starting point. So, uh, now I got four razors I'm going to be testing in this video. Also, so all these razors I I have used in the past, just on my neck and on my cheeks a little bit, uh, and they're all honed in the Shafton. One is the Thornbloom, the uh, 4H Thornbloom Full Hollow. And uh, next one's going to be my vintage uh, Frederick Reynolds. I'm sure people have seen this one before. Uh, this is like a near wedge or three quarter hollow, something like that. Uh, of course, my cape razor, three quarter hollow. And then the filly. So that's a half hollow also. So let's use a filly to cut it in. So can't wait for my appointment to get my eyes checked next week on the 14th actually. Just too much. All right. Nice. Uh, watching this guy, this, this professional barber, cutting this guy's beard down. Ended up giving him a clean shave. And he went through all this effort with his little electric clippers and did all this stuff. That worked really good, actually. Uh, of course, I'm not going to be able to tell until um, I do the, one of the... A pass with no hair on it because um, I want to check the smoothness of it also. Here's the cape razor. And uh, the guy, the guy actually uh, 
was saying that he's not going to do against the grain pass because it'll cause him problems. Weepers and shit. And I was watching how he shaves. He, they get to, they get they go all across his face. And I says, you know, when I do a pass, it's like, I go one down, one this way, and one this way, usually. Maybe a little more of a touch-up or something. And that's all I do. I never have skin irritations. Anyway, whatever. All right, so... Again, shaving like a champ. So I was telling that guy that uh, about myself a little bit, and I said, I don't even use clippers. I just get the straight razor and go for it, and it's gone. And look at that. So I guess what I'm going to do I'm cutting a horseshoe. And uh, my wife doesn't know what I'm my wife doesn't know what I'm gonna do. And uh, and everything. So All right, let's try the Frederick Reynolds. I've always loved his razor, it's been kind of cool. I think the Shepin's doing really good on these razors. But I'll tell you something. There's none of my razors in my portfolio that are not good razors, too. Um, why would I keep them, you know? <clears throat> Some razors, if I think they're not even worth the shit, I won't even try to sell them. So, let's try this. Okay, let's try the Escalatuna. Here all over my <laughs> I think my razors are doing pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. So I got uh, two pork roast pork butts in the oven, and uh, I'm gonna throw that hair away. No reason to keep that around. And uh, it's kind of fun. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. All right, I'm getting rid of this soap here. Let me just switch soap. I'll be back in two shakes of a lamb's tail. All right. I got the, another soap. Oh yeah, look at that. I'm just going to do um, I'm going to pick one razor and finish up. I think I'm going to go for the cape. Your old friend, the cape. So, all right, so let's do this.
Oh man, have I missed my smooth skin. I really have. Mm. Mm, what the hell's that thing? Right here? Yeah, I guess it was. Beating. Uh, should I go straight down and come out like this? Or should I go here and just go straight at that angle, that triangle? Uh. By inch, I guess. So once I get it established, then uh, it'll be easier to maintain. So this is the most crucial right here. And see the uh, The reason I was check, check, testing that electric razor is because it gets really long right here. So I might trim that back. Have some residual. Mm. Mm. That's a good lady. Alright. Just about done. When you shave off a beard, it's uh, <clears throat> it uh, skin's really sensitive there, <clears throat> so uh, Above the nose. 
the uh, balm, beard balm I was using. Put some on my mustache every time I use it, and my nose just broke out. Because it's all oil. Hey Mikey, I like it. <sighs> Something looks uneven here. Uh, so I can almost form a handlebar. Well, I can't figure it out right now. <clears throat> so, I'm just going to kind of keep on going. Be right back. All right, a little more soap. Man, this soap is nice. <clears throat> My wife's son's coming here with his girl, and uh, he's one of them kind of guys who just don't see the point in grooming. And, uh, but he, uh, Be right back, man. All right, now the piece de resistance. This is my stash of Cavendish from uh, Phoenix Artesian Accoutrements. But first, I'm gonna put on some of this great skin food from Mirsol. one of the greats. I need to use that more. It's kind of, uh, it's been, I've had it for a couple years already. I just haven't used it all. Let's have a second helping of it, huh? Well, I didn't need my clippers, so that's good. So, and here it is. Oh, 
I'll tune it up some more later. But for right now, let's, let's go see what Mama thinks about it. Okay, man, thanks for joining me for my birthday shave, and y'all have a good rest of the week. Y'all take care, man. Later. Bye.